Coco and, and Kenya. Kenya. Today we wanted to talk about a new sport that we are starting that we hope will catch on. I really called... hope that people enjoy this new game we're creating. Yeah. Um, It's a game that I think all kids and adults, <coughs> even hip chipmunks, you know, you can all enjoy it. Maybe. The it's... name of the game is... Um... The name of the game is... Now let's describe how you play Hermit Ball. Okay, so there are two teams and two there are teams. two people on each team. So you're on a basketball court and the two people on, let's say, X team are diagonal from each other. And the O team are diagonal from each other. So, you know, you're facing the opposite team. So, this is kind of making sense so far. I had a question involving old telephones. So basically, you know what's really funny? If I hit the button, it makes a noise. Basically, you're gonna play it with a muffin. Put the muffin in the middle of the court, and one person from the X or O team is gonna run up. <coughs> oh, that's most terrible. O team is gonna run up and get the first kick of the muffin. So that's gonna go kind of flying. The two, there's one X and one O. Who can get to the muffin first? No, I have a question. Yeah, what's your question? If you eat glass backwards. While all of this is happening, while X and O are racing to get to the muffin, the other person on the X team is running in place. It's a really important part. Whoever gets to the muffin first will kick it and it has to bounce off the wall it got, it's got to go from wall to wall to wall to wall, and can and it's gonna repeat. In terms of the bat, in the in terms of the basketball nets, can you describe where X is when he's running in place? Well, like in front of. And one why of the does it hoops. have to be a boy? It really could be a boy or a girl. Or a chipmunk, you know. And whoever gets to the muffin first after that has to kick it into the audience. And if the person who catches it is wearing something that is red, then the team gets a point. And you just repeat that until you get to 30 points. Now, I have a question. If there is a boy and he is looking for his mother during a game, but he has a red shirt on, mm -hmm. and the muffin comes flying out and it hits him in the face. Is he allowed to eat the muffin while looking for his mother, or does he throw it back, find his mother, ask for it in return, and then eat it with his mouth hole? He would just throw it back and continue looking for his mother, because no. it would require... Um, the game would require using the muffins some more. They do have muffins on hand, but it's good to use the same one. This is the new sport. It's called Hermit Ball, as we I said earlier. I have a question about the ball. It's a muffin. Yes, it is. Why don't you call it Hermit Muffin? Well, we could call that too. But it's already named in the dictionary. Yeah, it is. Thank you for watching White Cookie Meat. One, two, you three. Shut up. A quick update about my life that's going on. I recently got a job as a tractor man and it's a really simple job um, I do I do it about once every three hours <laughs> you still my watch no so basically I put the steering wheel on and I get paid like a hundred dollars an hour to do that guys, so yeah bye guys we love you have a you. great night by the have way a great, have a great morning too bye guys chicken